Do you know one of my favorite pastimes is? Is to go to different physiotherapy clinics and take their anatomy spine that they have and remove the red disc bulge that they have on it. Every time I remove one of those red bulging discs, I feel like I've done the world a favor. I feel like I've saved thousands of patients from chronic low back pain. Please do me a favor. Do not show patients that anatomical model that shows that red bulge disc sticking out and hitting a nerve root. We don't know what that does to people's brain and mental image and what the cause of their back pain is. When in fact, most times, that red bulge is not even true, that it's not a permanent thing and it's not going to cause them compression of the nerve root as it's indicated by those models. I'd like to share with you three studies on sequestrated discs. This study shows the majority of patients with extruded lumbar disc herniation might have reduction in size of herniated disc in the long run, along with improvement in symptoms and function with conservative care. Why don't we share this type of studies with the patient? Next study I'd like to share with you concludes that posterior disc protrusion is present in 78.7% .7 of asymptomatic adults. And finally, I would like to share with you Patients with disc sequestrations may be managed conservatively. So what can we conclude? We can conclude do not catastrophize disc herniations or disc sequestrations. And the vast majority of people, they're retractable and symptom recovery occurs.